Alternative bars aren't just for hipsters. They actually serve some good purpose. So if you're looking at purchasing a bar like this, the Malaco, you're in luck because I'm going to do a review. I know what it's like to be at the product page and be thinking about, is it really worth getting this ordered at a bike shop waiting for it to come in? And I think it is. So I ordered the bars, put them on my bike, did this pretty rad test ride up Mount Eminem in the Santa Cruz Mountains, looped back to my house, about four hours of riding so that I could see how my hands felt on the bars in all the positions over that time. Uh, I didn't wear gloves, so there's that. And you can see I rode on gravel, pavement, uphill, downhill, the whole mix, and a little bit of rain and a lot of wind. Overall, I think these bars are pretty awesome. My hands did get a little numb, not from the cold, just from being on the handlebars for four hours towards the end of the ride. And that happens to me with my other bars. It's a cool rainbow there though, so that's awesome. The key things to know is that these handlebars are fun to ride with, they give you lots of cool options for different grip locations, and they have plenty of space to clip on whatever type of accessory you may have. So they're not just for hipsters, they're for everybody. Pick up a pair and install them on your bike. The best way to support this channel is to donate $5 to my PayPal tip jar, subscribe to my channel, when I reach 1,000 subscribers, I will donate $1,000 to Santa Cruz Mountains Trail Stewardship. Like and comment on the content. It's been great hanging out with you today. See you around.